again. Good to see you all today. And here we are going to take a look at this encoder. The encoder is manufactured by Lenore and Bauer. It's part number GEL 208-V-00500B00 B001. Here's the pinouts right here of this connector right here. The keyway is pin A. So pin A is ground. Uh, pin F is the supply voltage positive input. D is N if there's a reference signal. I believe there's no uh, Z pulse on this encoder. And B and C. C is the A pulse and B is the B pulse, and they call it track one and track two, and reference signal. That would be A, B, and Z. Now, according to the part number breakdown here, a dash means there's no Z pulse, and we have a dash right here after the V. The V indicates that we have two square wave signals shifted by 90 degrees. And according to the data plate, the input voltage is 10 to 30 volts DC. So we're going to apply uh, 12 volts to pin F and A. Let's get our red wire for our positive DC voltage. These wires. Uh, attached to these socket pins and we're going to use the socket pins and wires to join our encoder to the outside world. Now let's take the red wire and we're going to attach that to pin F. Pin F is the supply voltage input of this encoder. There's a keyway right here A, B, C, D, E, F. We take the black wire and apply that to pin ground, which is A. There is A. Let's move these over here. We'll connect those to our power supply. Set to 12 volts. There's one connection to the power supply. Here is the other connection to the power supply. The black wire going to ground, the red wire going to the plus 12 volts DC. Now we're going to take our yellow wire and connect that to channel A, the A pulse, and that is on pin C, A, B, C. Let's connect that to channel 1 probe of the oscilloscope. Here's channel 1. We take the blue wire, connect that to pin B. B is the B channel, the B pulse. We're going to connect the B pulse to channel 2 of the oscilloscope. There we go, we're all hooked up. Now let's go over in front of the oscilloscope and we'll see what the waveforms look like for that A pulse and B pulse. I'm going to rotate the shaft of the encoder and right now if I were looking into the shaft of the encoder it's rotating clockwise and you can see if I can rotate this steadily you can see that the top waveform leading edge is ahead of the lower waveforms leading edge. A is leading B. So 
So let's go back counterclockwise. Now you can see that the lower waveform is ahead of the upper waveform. The leading edge of B is ahead of the leading edge of A. B is leading A when I rotate counterclockwise. Isn't that amazing? Clockwise? Counterclockwise? Clockwise? Counterclockwise? Now we'll move up to the other oscilloscope set to XY mode and you'll get to see what it looks like when we rotate clockwise and counterclockwise. I've got this scope set to XY mode. Again, channel 1 is the A and channel 2 is the B. I'm going to rotate clockwise as viewed into the shaft of the encoder. Look at that. If I speed up, it looks like a square. Let's go back the other way. This is counterclockwise. I'll try to go slow. Clockwise. Counterclockwise. Let's see what it would look like if, if we were missing a pulse. Let's disconnect the B. This is the B channel. Disconnected. Let's see what the A channel looks like. Huh. This is clockwise. Counterclockwise. Okay, let's hook the B channel back up and we'll disconnect the A. This is simulating that the A channel is missing. It's clockwise. Counterclockwise. Let's hook the A channel back up. And we have our four quadrants again. Clockwise, counterclockwise. It's quadrant one, quadrant two, quadrant three, quadrant four. It's a good encoder. There's nothing wrong with that encoder. I'd like to perform an experiment, but I don't know if I have the patience for it. What I would like to do is make one complete revolution and count how many times I see like a quadrant one. So there's one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I wonder if through one complete revolution we would be able to count how many pulses per revolution this encoder has. Now according to the data sheet and the data plate of the encoder, it's a 500 pulse count encoder. I don't know if I got the patience to rotate that thing slow enough and count through one uh, complete revolution. Let me uh, take a little bit of a break and I'll see if it can be done and we'll come back and try it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, <laughs> 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 7, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, <laughs> Woo. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200. Whew. Where are we at now? I can't tell. My mark is on the other side of the cog. Okay, that was 200. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two. 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 3, 4, 5, 6, 
seven, eight, nine, seventy, seventy one, seventy two, seventy three, seventy four, seventy five, seventy six, seventy seven, seventy eight, seventy nine, eighty, eighty one, eighty two, eighty three, eighty four, eighty five, eighty six, eighty seven, eighty eight, eighty nine, ninety. 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 300. Whew. Okay. Oh, shoot. I can see the mark on the bottom of the, of the gear. Okay, that was 300. Oh, <laughs> I think that was four. <laughs> Okay, let's call it two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 400. 100 more to go. Give or take a few because I've been miscounting. <laughs> okay. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, Let's see where our mark is. We're almost there. That was 50. 51, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 
93, 493 with, for one complete revolution. And the other seven pulses that we didn't make, we didn't make it to 500, but the other seven pulses were because I miscounted. <laughs> so this is a 500 pulse in uh, per revolution encoder. I had never done that before. That is all right. That's one way if you never know what the pulse count of an encoder is. Set your scope to uh, XY mode. Uh, make you a mark on the shaft and make one complete revolution while you count this, the, uh, the uh, quadrants, the, just one quadrant. And that'll give you your pulse count. That was a fun experiment. I like that. <laughs> okay. All right. I hope y'all is having a good day. After I get out of here, I'm going to go over to my daughter's house and spend the day over there with her and the grandkids. That'll be a fun time. Try to spend as much time as you can with your family. Families are hard to come by nowadays. And if you got one, spend some time with them. All right. Let me turn that scope off. Set it back to normal mode. There we go. Okay. We'll see you all next time.